So me and this old pair of cats decide to take a road trip, see? I am traveling with these cats, the real nice cats and all, but we kept feuding. What avenue do you want to take? Where's our mile counter? How many highways left? That was the exit I really liked last time. I told them to handle the reservations at the hotel, and when we show up, instead of one single, they gave us two doubles, and the rooms were right next to each other, so we got the holy grail of hotel rooms, the shared door. I have had a lot going on at work lately. My boss wanted me to file all these papers. I had to keep the piles in control. I developed a rather ingenious surveillance system to keep them under control. Gotta get out. We visited this village of indigenous people. They were a blast. You know, they faced a lot of persecution when our kind started claiming their land. It's really too bad if you think about it. Great people. You ever seen that movie Poltergeist? That's what kind of party this was. It was great. So I wanted to backpack in hostels and experience the real road like Jack Kerouac and the Deleuze sisters did. My friends wanted to play it by the book. So they got these pamphlets and they were dragging me around to tourist traps like Desolation Anchor in Boys, Idaho. It was dreadful. At the natural park, our attendant was this tall, left-handed guy. It was really weird watching him do stuff. Felt like I walked into Mirrorland or something. I'm playing tennis with this hot shot pro tennis player. He says that the winner gets to take a ride in his hovercraft. When I see this thing, my mouth is watering. Pro engine, twin dials. I mean, you can monitor vital stats with this thing. So we decided to visit the Lettuce Museum. It was pretty much the usual fair. You had the Lettuce Monument, the Lettuce Memorial. It was pretty much what you'd expect. We saw a lot of different types of lettuce. I think it was run by a con artist. So I'm taking this guy on. And he keeps cheating. I'm trash talking him, giving him the business. He's got like this bag with a colony of insects in it and he's repeatedly dropping it. And I'm allergic to insects and so I'm sneezing. And I'm pretty ticked by this point. One of my friends was really particular about clean doorknobs. He read all the business about it on 2020 or something. So we could get sick just by touching them. And so he would never let us touch them. We usually got stuck in our hotel rooms. I love lighthouses. We must have had about a thousand on the coast. They warn ships to stay back from the land so they don't crash. I don't think we give enough credit to brave people. Keeping out of trouble? It's about all you can do these days. I developed some sort of degenerative muscle disease. By the end, I couldn't even lift my shoes. Too much drinking on the beach. I love America. I love a good road trip. On a hot summer's day, you just pack up your systems and hit the old patriotic road.